Hey, how's everybody doing? Lorenzo from San Francisco just wanted to talk a little bit about uh, how's uh, San Francisco doing. And I got some news out here for a company here. Yep. Uh, we're probably basically moving out from San Francisco uh, to Idaho. Yes, to Idaho. We've been here in San Francisco basically all our lives. And uh, we uh, basically do roadside service. So I'm basically going to see if I can transfer uh, my business or, you know, help other people out there in uh, Idaho uh, to do uh, basically roadside service what we do here in San Francisco California but yeah you know um, San Francisco is a good place you know uh, but uh, the only thing is is it's, uh, it's getting too too uh, too expensive out here The gas, which everybody knows that it went up, you know, and here's some of seven, eight, you know, a gallon. And basically to have a, a you know, a roadside service is not that easy like it used to be before. And uh, here in San Francisco. The gas is very high, you know, and you, basically you know fill, fill your tank and it don't last like it, it, it used to be I used to drive uh, my truck here every day to do the roadside service and basically that got stopped I stopped driving my truck it just been sitting for a while now when the gas went high so now, you know, we use our transit connect. It's a, it's a four cylinder and we have our Volkswagen Beetle that we use. Uh, so yeah, basically that the, the business here is, you know, it's okay, but it's not like before after all the pandemic and all the things that are happening right now, matter of fact, you know, uh, it's not looking the greatest like it it was before so I believe it's time for us to uh, hit the road to Idaho and um, see what happens over there and, um, just get something started up there if not uh, maybe uh, help other people out there if they need some you know for roadside service or anything like uh, you know to do with the auto industrial but yeah, San Francisco, it, it, for us, it, we, we're, we're leaving, we're leaving. Um, we see a lot of things happening here that nobody talks about. And, you know, it, it's a lot of stinning out here. People are just breaking windows. Uh, their mind's not all there. Uh, you know, they get the help that they need, but it, it's not working. It's not working uh, for the problems that they have in other people. Uh, they're trying to, uh, you know, help uh, much as much as it can, but it, it's not. It's not. It's not happening. You know, it's not happening. What what the help out here in San Francisco? Um, it seems like everybody, uh, they're just walking around, not normally, you know, and not just one or two person. I, I'm talking about a lot of, lot of people out here. Uh, they basically don't know what they're doing. Uh, somehow they kind of deceive. Uh, it's, 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 it's just don't know what, what, what really. Uh, may or that the seed came from it might came from 
different all types of different materials that you know and, and shots that they take and different stuff that they, they took and, and it's making everybody really really crazy put it that way it's really making them really crazy out here like in San Francisco and they need help but I mean I constantly see that every day and it's not just one or two people it basically is more and more uh, is happening here in San Francisco you know a lot of people have lost their houses and they basically live in cars or boats or cardboard boxes or right on the corner with a blanket and they have you know RVs everywhere uh, basically I don't have anything against nothing like that I, I, I'm just saying is it's really more happening we always talk about this in years and years now but the, the problem is that it, I don't think we'll never stop talking about this here or anywhere around the world what's really going on and it's getting more worse I mean how can you survive with that gas you you have choices right now basically get gas or buy food to eat I mean I know some people or less people can't can't really do it you can't really do it I have no choice you don't have no choice to either get gas or food you can't really travel maybe a lot of people out there um, have the capital or have the good jobs and uh, have to succeed and, and been doing it but they're failing it too basically uh, what's happening out here But it's, it's, it's not looking good. All I can say is not looking good. So I just wanted to mention that a little bit. That's why I'm leaving San Francisco. Uh, because uh, it's a little bit slow. Uh, things are getting expensive out here. The food. You can't really find good food. Uh, if you do, you, got, you might find some good food. But you have to pay attention. Uh, you know, apples are, the apples are really expensive, you know, and I'm, I'm basically growing myself my, my vegetables here at the parking lot, uh, you know, like lettuce, you know, little tomato, you know, whatever I could grow here and to have my little lettuce and, and you know, salad, whatever I could basically, uh, you know, could grow. And go a little bit fast when it goes fast, and definitely have a good taste on that. But yeah, it's it's it's, a, it's really getting in a, out of hand here, and I think everywhere else to survive. You know, you have to survive. But, and it's still people saying, you know, you can see that people are saying a lot of stuff is coming. You know, get prepared. So you know, and it's a lot of stuff going on out here. So anyways, I uh, just want to let you know that we are moving and we're going to take a drive from San Francisco to Idaho. So uh, I'm going to keep filming uh, once I leave. We're not sure when we're leaving yet in, from San Francisco to Idaho, maybe in a week or two, maybe a couple months. Uh, we already have a plan to get up there. So hope uh, I'll keep you keep you uh I keep you uh, uh touch and uh just to let you know what's uh going on here so uh yeah so to the next next time uh we'll see you later be safe out there uh make sure you have enough water and food in case any uh collapse happens and for an emergency we'll size this we'll see you back in another video thanks a lot
can you uh, thumbs up let me know how that how you like the video what you like to talk about and like it and follow thank you